so my name is Crystal Land and I teach a women's literature elective in the fall and while the title is women's literature and we read a lot of books like The Handmaid's Tale and The God of Small Things a huge focus of the class is gender issues gender studies current events and what's going on with women and men in the world today I teach modern drama and playwriting that's one course and we read plays that were written generally between the 1870s and the 1960s. Um, and we write plays. Uh, we study a bunch of different styles like naturalism, expressionism, impressionism, uh, existentialism, absurdism. And we write in those styles. And then there are three major plays that students need to write uh, for grades in addition to a final which covers um, an amalgamation of at least three of the different styles that we've studied during the year. I'm Ms. E and I teach alienation as my English senior elective in the fall and in that class we read books about outsiders, about people who don't fit in, about people who rebel or break the rules and then have to face these consequences of being ostracized, of, re of being rejected, of um, not being accepted. And so we look at the causes and the consequences of being alienated, of being an outsider and we also try to think about how to deal with that, how to approach your alienation. You know, do you embrace it, own it, or do you try to fit back in again? You know, what are the different ways you could deal with um, being an outsider? And we read these great books. We start with Invisible Man by Ralph Ellison. Um, then we move on to The Metamorphosis by Kafka. We read Frankenstein by Mary Shelley. And then we end with The Stranger by Albert Camus. And along the way, we'll watch movies. We'll watch um, Frankenstein, of course. We'll watch 127 Hours. We'll watch this great German movie called Run, Lolo, Run. We'll watch um, District 9. Um, and I'm hoping um, in the fall to also watch this movie called Her that I just saw um, that just came out this past winter, and it seems really perfect for our class. So it's a great mix of movies and books and lots of good discussion. So I'm Andy Spear, and I teach in the fall the class called The Short Story. And in The Short Story, we read a lot of short stories. Um, a different story every day in a range of different styles, always a different writer. Um, and we look at stories from a couple of different perspectives. I mean, in general, from the perspective of the reader, um, thinking about them as this, you know, a traditional student of English. Um, what devices are being used in this story? What's the story about? What are its ideas and how is it communicating them? But then also we try to look at them from the perspective of the writer. Um, how's the story made? What were the choices that the writer is making to sort of amplify the way the story is communicating and how the story makes you feel? Um, and of course people get a chance to do some of their own writing, which is always kind of exciting too. Um, my name is David Enlow. I've been teaching at Head Royce for 37 years and I've been teaching uh, an elective uh, on Shakespeare's plays. It's a class that I have tremendously enjoyed teaching and that the students who have taken the class have very much enjoyed taking. Um, we read a comedy, As You Like It, a history play, Henry IV, Part I, and a tragedy, King Lear. We attend at least one performance and we do a lot of group work and presentations. So the students have been very enthusiastic about the class and I have been very enthusiastic about teaching the class. So I hope you will consider signing up for this class.